Hello, this is Eli Hall with AMS Landscaping out of Phoenix, Arizona. We are actually gonna do an aeration video on how to uh, DIY doing your own aeration. Uh, first of all, we make sure that the yard has been watered the day before pretty heavily so that the ground is more, more moist in order for the plugs to kind of get a deeper plug with the aeration machine. Uh, and we're starting off right now by putting down some flags, as you can see. We're running the sprinklers to make sure that we mark all the locations of the sprinkler heads so we don't hit them with the aeration machine. Here is one of the sprinklers and the flag we, we picked up over at Home Depot just to mark the location of the sprinklers. As you can see, we marked all of them here in this, uh, this area. Here is the aeration machine we just rented from uh, the local Home Depot. Uh, they'll pretty much show you how to use them when you're on site. Uh, we filled the front tank here with water. This tank here, there's a little spout that's on this edge here and they'll show you how to lower the uh, their aerating teeth that really do the plugging. And uh, you just gotta clean off the machine when you return it, but they pretty much show you how to use and operate everything on the machine before you get started. So make sure you get help from your local professional at your local Home Depot. You can see here the holes that the plugs leave in the ground and this benefits the soil. It gives the roots um, more air to absorb and it gives the, the water a better chance to absorb in the soil so you have less runoff and better absorption rates. This also helps with the leveraging your, your turf fertilizers so it, it does it actually gets to the roots better and it's optimized better in order to just give you the maximum results on, uh, on your soil. Now after we get done, uh, we've basically gone both ways here on the lawn. We go, we go one direction and then we go an absolute perpendicular direction and we pull these plugs out of the ground as you can see. They're pretty, uh, pretty large plugs. When you get the soil moist enough it'll do a, a like about a one inch plug which is great and you can just leave these here on the ground and um, just with the water uh, every time you water it'll dissipate them and break them down and they go back into the soil and then of course over the next mow or two you'll they'll all eventually get picked up but this is pretty much how the aeration is done um, if you have any other questions uh, feel free to give us a call number here is 602-944-0421. Also check out our website at aclawns.com. Uh, please, uh, if you see this somewhere on social media, please share it and um, follow us on Facebook and subscribe to our YouTube page. Thanks much, make it a great day.